my weigh-in. Um, this is the first one in four weeks now from when I had my operation, obviously four weeks ago. Um, if you don't follow me, it's the, um, I had keyhole surgery to have my gallstones and gallbladder removed. Um, so I've just been sticking to plan where I can, when I can. It has, I haven't fully been 100% on plan uh, the past two days. So Tuesday, Wednesday, just gone. I have done two SP days just to try and help myself because I'm a bit bloated because Mother Nature is due next week. Next week. Now my mum's over there if you're wondering who I'm looking at. She's just too rude to come join me. <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, so Craig's been helping me as best as he can and like doing like jacket potatoes and I did batch cook some food before I went into hospital, just some uh, spaghetti bolognese mince mix without the pasta, so I've been having some of that in jacket potatoes, I've been having beans and salad, but only the past couple of weeks, first two weeks it was eat what I can, when I can, because I weren't really wanting too much to be honest because I wasn't really hungry and I've been stuck in bed most of the time I've been out twice today it's the third day I've been out since my operation so I haven't been active at all I've just been bed bound and hobbling around at my flat as much as I can so yeah mum and Craig have been helping as well but yeah it's been a bit of a blur but I decided that today is the day I'm going back to group I'm gonna sort my issues out get on it so I'm gonna show you my book first Actually, I'll show you my plaque. I'll show you my plaque. So this week, which I'm okay with because I was expecting it anyway, considering the previous circumstances, is I gained one and a half pound, which is a total loss of eighty two and a half. Now, the eighty two and a half is including the little bit of weight that um, I'd lost pri prior, prior, prior to it, prior to oh, yeah. the world. Yeah, yeah. Trying to sound all fancy, but I'm really not. But yeah. 82 and a half altogether. With Slimming World, I've lost three stone and half a pound. <laughs> I did get my three and a half stone award, but I've been struggling the past year going up and down like a yo yo, uh, trying to get to my four stone award. I was a couple of pounds away, but I've just been having issues and we don't know why, so I'm just gonna get on it. So, in total, 82 and a half, and this week's one half, as I said, I'm fine with it. In group, me and mum did buy these to try. I've just started to try mine. I like them. I think they taste like sweets. I really do like them. It makes a change to having chocolate ones all the time because all the others are just all chocolate. But these are limited edition. So if you do like them, um, stuff up. I've got a box of these ones because these are my all time favourite. And I've got a box of these ones because I ran out and I really like them ones too. So yeah, what did you think of the uh, the bar? If you can it's see. It's alright. It's not made on it as such, but. I'd still buy it. I would buy them again. I think they taste like sweets. Yeah. And nice and chewy, so they last a bit apple. longer as well. Yeah. Really fruity. That's nice. But... That's Harry, by the way. Not Angel. That's my mum's dog. That's <laughs> Angel's brother. <laughs> if, if you're wondering why Angel's hair suddenly grown back. Yeah. He knows what we're talking about. Yeah. Oh, Stephen. Oh, Stephen's ringing my mum. So you're probably going to hear Hello. her in the background now. Oh, yeah, anyway. Um, so, I... For the week ahead, I have bought one of these. Oh, it's like a Fitbit, that was quick. but it's not a Fitbit. But it's as good as it was uh, fifteen pound on eBay. And I've got the app and everything, so I'm going to try and be as active as I can. I'm not going to push myself, but I'm going to try and do a bit more walks as long as the weather stays nice. Take Angel out, even just around the block or whatnot. Just get out and try and get myself more active without hurting myself. Um, I have brought a 12 week countdown from today to keep me on it and focus for the 12 weeks because I really, really, really want to try and lose as much weight as possible before SlimCon, which if you didn't know is September the 16th in Manchester. Can't wait for that, I'm so excited to meet everybody, including you guys if you can come. Um, but yeah, so I just want to, I'm not setting myself a goal to lose um, a particular weight by then, but I want to just have as much of a loss yeah. as possible so yeah, I will be doing a few more SP days I'm gonna at least try and do mm. two SP days a week okay. but it's not set in stone but I'm gonna at least yeah, try for two out. so that's my plan to keep me going and motivated is to go and get my bottom into yeah, group stay in group pick up tips and tricks get some ideas speak you know speak of what I'm feeling get it out 
Control. Just go to Greg. Um, alongside with the 12 week countdown, I, I bought um, a new food journal. I am still going to use my other one once I've finished this one. But I just thought fresh book, fresh mind, fresh ideas for 12 weeks just to get on it. And something, you know, a nice new book is always it's always nice and, you know, inspiring to have something pretty. But it's really good. And um, you can do the chart in the back as well. And there's other bits and pieces in there to fill out. Oh. So yeah, that's my plan for the week ahead. I don't think there's anything else I need to add. I told you, every time I speak to you, you'll hear sirens in the background, every time. I'm telling you, this road is shameless. Can you hear it? Have you got anything you need to add? What's your plan for the week ahead? Me? Um, mm. Stop some looking salad. There was that, what's it, salad thing that... Salad in a jar. We had in a, in a jar, yeah. This is new to mum. She doesn't realise I've got a YouTube video yeah, on no, um, I my know. salad in a jar. Yeah. And I'm doing that one. She wants to try those because she's never had them before. And then I want to do a breakfast one. Because I haven't done that yet either. Not either because it's only just me. A breakfast what? In a jar. Breakfast in a jar? You have oats in a jar, don't you? Overnight oats. Overnight oats, that's the one. I thought you meant you were going to do like a sausages and bacon in a jar. No, hi. <coughs> you never know you. I've got to do stuff. You know, a bit of a special one. I was with me that I'll take them to my son and my husband. I couldn't think of me was then. Uh, they uh, don't eat the same things as me. They're mean. Yeah, they don't do much encouragement, she's basically no. on her own. So that's yeah. why I have to try and help her over the phone. Yeah. But she doesn't ring me enough. No. But yeah, I'm going to try and help her meal plan today before she goes yeah. home. To keep What's that honest. I've made, uh, for dinner, I've done the minced beef and onion pasties, which you would have saw in my tea last night. I've done two extra for me and mum to have for dinner today, which she's never tried to have. Um, either on its own or with a bit of salad, depends how we feel. But yeah. That's something different for her to try. She only tries new things when I do for her. Yeah. But you know She's not adventurous. I've got to try and do it for myself. Well, because they're boring my two at the time. They're boring. <laughs> anyway. That's my... Oh, wait. What did you tell them how you did? Um, I put on three and a half, but I knew it was something. So I thought it was going to be more... Oh God, I'm gone, gone. So she knows what she did. Anyway, my brother's Hello. ringing now because we've got to go meet him in town. Um, I've got to go as well because I've got the opticians Hello. at one o'clock, which is in less than half an hour. Because I keep getting migraines oh, and headaches and my doctor said that it's possible right, that I need bigger in. lenses because I'm straining through the right, little so lenses. So, Trouble. yes. So I'm going to go and try and sort that out now. So that's my week ahead. I'm positive, I'm happy, I'm focused, I'm honest. I've ordered as well, not that I can use it yet, but I have ordered the weighted hula hoop. So when my tummy and everything gets all healed and the stuff's gone away, this video is going to be so annoying to you guys, I'm sorry. But anyway, this uh, I bought what I ordered right. one, so it'll be here. <laughs> Crying out loud, mother. <laughs> I have to apologise, guys. It's a, it's a noir today. Anyway, I bought one of the weighted hula hoops that everybody's been doing. And trim with Tan and Helen. Helen smashes it and Tanya's proper cracking on it. So I will be doing that when I get better. I'm going to go with my brother's head now and Harry won't shut up and neither will she. Thanks for watching. Love you all bunches. And I'll see you all in the next one. Bye.